Hello and good day. So I'm coming to you today with another story. So I had a gentleman that reached out to me, an older guy. He's about, mm, I believe, 76, 77 years old. Um, he's been uh, dealing with like depression, uh, anxiety, and just like very low energy. Now he is a diabetic, but he's been telling me that he's been waking up in the middle of the night and he's been noticing that his foot has been throbbing. His toes have also been throbbing too. Now he said this is something new because um, he's never experienced anything like this uh, before. Now talking to his wife, she even was telling me that he's not taking his medication uh, the way he should be taking it. So he's starting to get pale, um, losing a lot of weight. He just doesn't have really motivation to do anything. Now he owns a construction company and um, he owns a lot of heavy equipment. So he was on a job and he had his equipment at the job and the police called him because they said a piece of his equipment uh, caught on fire so when he got to the job um, the fire started from the inside of the cab of this machine now everything was locked up so they couldn't it just didn't make sense they didn't understand how this this happened so uh, it caught on fire then to find out uh, it was an issue with his insurance so the insurance wouldn't even cover it so that was just like a loss so he noticed that things was just continuously going downhill. Um, a lot of the jobs that he had, he was losing the jobs because he couldn't complete them. Different things kept coming up. His uh, equipment, his trucks kept breaking down. So he just kept saying he just was having bad luck. Uh, just back, back to back bad luck. Um, he had a lot of anger that started forming in him and he told me that uh, he was contemplating on actually killing the man one night so uh, just a lot of anger and rage that was uh, just coming out of the blue and and this was uh, this was attacking him uh, also his memory his focus is uh, is off he's having a hard time remembering things his money has dried up but his wife is saying that he's continue you know continues to help people and he's giving them money she can't understand this so I automatically saw that it was a few issues that was uh, happening with this now the first thing I saw is that he had what we call a hoarder spirit now this is a demon that will cause you to uh, collect things or uh, you have a lot of clutter you know so and his wife said this is true so he constantly collects things uh, very junky uh, a lot of clutter around him this type of thing attracts demons so that's why it's always good to be clean and be organized so that was the first issue so that opened doors for demons i also saw that someone was working witchcraft on him and uh <clears throat> this was another issue that he was dealing with so he told me that he started to have like dreams and visions of demons uh, having sex with him he saw a demon put his penis in his mouth so he said he's just never seen anything this demonic before so he knew that something wasn't right and again um this demon even had him not taking his meta medication so he's looking bad and lost a lot of weight so i've been working with him and yeshua is freeing him he's getting better the jobs are starting to roll in his energy has come back uh that pain that he was feeling and his foot and his toes that pain has left so he's doing good with that um, so he's getting back on his he's getting back on his feet he told me he knows he has a good idea of who did this witchcraft to him I told him don't retaliate you sure will handle that so uh, everyone be stay everyone be safe and just, just watch out for this witchcraft have a good day